build the upper ten on Ugandan All Star. Word. Yeah, shout out to my boy that kid Bill, one of the Uganda All Star baby. Keep it locked right here. It's your boy Navio representing Clear Cut. You go flow, baby. Yeah. You already know. <laughs> they signed a deal with uh, Radiant Products, which yeah. have different products that have to do with products of beauty, hair, you know, things that have to have to make sure that ladies look good. Mainly because you know I have a big following, and I I look good, so anyone would want <laughs> look good like me. Had to make sure that the money terms are good as well. Yeah. yeah so we signed the deal and we're kicking it, kicking it off already. Well, it's the first product that I'm um, being a brand ambassador too. Yeah. Mainly because it's that you know, you as Ugandan, I, sh I don't want to say celebrities, but presenters, artists, and all that. We haven't yet gotten the culture of you know having deals with different companies, yeah. and I think that's one thing that we need to work on. And I think we need to work on management and PR. So so far, I'm doing good. But of course, I welcome other deals as well. Okay. Yeah. So what's up with you and school, though? Because we we, we are confused. Mm. What's going um, on? Me and school. Uh, I always try to keep my private life private and my public life public. Yeah. What I'm trying to say is that sixty percent of my life is actually public. So my private life, I try to keep it private. But you know, school is in the pipeline. I'm going to university soon. It's not going to be in Uganda, and definitely not going to be in Africa. So what do you think of uh, style in, uh, in Uganda? Because I remember, what hours were those celebrities turned up wearing far? No, it was actually at the Douglas Purple Party. Oh, Douglas uh, Purple Party, yeah. Yeah, and it's just because, you know, I think fashion and, and style is something that is growing in Uganda. I don't think it's there yet. Just like I think that the music industry also has to grow. Yeah. And that's what I think about the fashion and style industry. I really think, you know, the artists in Uganda and, you know, people who call themselves celebrities, yeah. they don't invest them in, in the way they look and the way they out, come out there in the public. Yeah. And which is just a mere fact. Like if you look at people in Africa, other artists in Africa, they invest in how they look, they have to look good, clean, fresh. Yeah. You know, that's one thing that even puts you out there. You don't just want to be, you know, hard because you just sing, you have to look good as well. Yeah. So I really think, you know, there's a lot to learn. I really think that people have to learn to look good, to look fresh, to look clean. Yeah. Because you know what, it's an essential of life. Yeah. yeah. No so one wants to be with some people that are trying right now. Jump into think, that ace up. Uh, <laughs> Who needs to change? I think Radio News are doing good, Exodus is doing good. Um yeah. Who let, needs to change? Let, let the list go to two. <laughs> Who needs to change? Top three. Who needs to change? You know, they know themselves, they look into the mirror every day, right?